Welcome to our SSRS Tips and Tricks video. Today, we're tackling a question that many report developers encounter. Our viewer is trying to achieve alternating row colors in their SSRS report, but they're facing a challenge when it comes to column grouping. Let's dive into the details. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're going to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully getting you to that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy just like me and get through to that resolution. Now, let's get started. To achieve alternating row colors in SSRS with column groups, we need to modify our approach. First, let's understand the issue. The expression you used works well for simple row structures. When you have column groups, the row number function behaves differently. Instead of counting rows, it counts groups. To fix this, we need to use a different scope for the row number function. Replace your row group name with the actual name of your row group. This will ensure that the row number function counts the rows within that specific group allowing for proper alternating colors. After updating the expression, preview your report. You should now see that every other row within your column groups is colored alternately as intended. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To alternate row colors in SSRS with column groups, start by adding a hidden column named row number to your table. Next, set an expression for the row number text box using the running value function to ensure unique values. Finally, apply an expression to the background color of the details row to alternate colors based on the row number. This method combines last name and entity name to create unique values, which is essential for the running value function. Hope this helps you achieve alternate row colors in your SSRS report. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To achieve alternate row colors in SSRS with column groups, use the running value function instead of row number. This method utilizes the field from your details row. And that's it guys. We've gone through the solutions and I'm hoping that it resolved your issue. If it did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers. Thank you.